G'day, it's Rob here again. Well, I recently reviewed this absolute cracker of a little steam engine from uh, Sterling Kit. And at the time I said that I'm going to put a drive pulley on this end of the crankshaft. There's provision for it here if you wanted to go the full diameter. Uh, and you can also drive off that end of some shafts there as well. But I'm going to put the drive pulley here. That way you can spread the load between the, the end uh, feet or rests. And so the load will be pulling, you know, from the sort of near the middle rather than on one end where it could pull the end around. So, yeah. I've machined up a uh, a pulley in brass, and I'm going to fit it on, and we'll try driving something with it. See how uh, how well this thing can drive something. So, being in brass, it should work in and look really nice. I'll put it on. I've got two grub screws, got one each side, done diagonally opposite. So that looks pretty damn good, doesn't it? It works in beautifully. Looks like a factory job. Whoa, away she goes. <laughs> That's great, isn't it? Let's try something else. <laughs> Look at that sucker go!
Evet olsun. Perfect. Isn't it great? So the next job will be to put a um, condenser catcher to run that steam into. That should look good as well. Rimmer up. Got some sting. She just chugs away happily at low speed as well. That's the sign of a good steam engine when it can just chug over like that. Alright, so the next project, the moisture catcher. Alright, I'll see you next time. Catcher.